Hi, this is Natalie with an update on my uh, experiment using the uh, Ginkgo Biloba. I've been doing it for about three weeks now. And you know, I've only uh, been taking one a day. I know that the um, experiment that had been done in the laboratories were doing um, two a day, but uh, that was really bothering my stomach, so I just cut it down to one a day. And um, I'm gonna have to probably take two because um, I just don't see any difference yet. And by now, I'm pretty sure that I should be seeing something. Now, I have had some questions about what the bottle looked like. I had posted pictures, but just in case you didn't get to see those, here's the bottle of Ginkgo Biloba. And I got that at Whole Foods, obviously. <laughs> as indicated by the huge writing on the bottle. Um, one thing that I do feel is really helping me a lot, um, my uh, skin and my nails and my hair are uh, benefiting a lot, I believe, from taking this vitamin D. Now, I did tell you in my last video that, um, I, that I had the pills, and these are 5,000 I use, and then I also, had um, heard from somebody that taking it in liquid form would be better because then your uh, stomach lining wouldn't have to absorb it. The liquid would go straight to your bloodstream. And so that looks like this. But here's my problem with that. When you, uh, it's not, they don't have like a dropper on here. So it's more just like this. I hope that's gonna be visible to you, but you see, you just do that. And so you have to actually, you know, shake it like really, <laughs> it's not easy. And then when you shake it like that, you know, it, I'm not even quite sure the measurement of this um, amount that gets onto my hand. So I can't even say for sure if I'm getting the full 2000 IUs that I'm supposed to be getting per drop. So I have opted to stop taking the liquid form um, because of the dropper that, that this company has put on there. So I've just been sticking with the pills and frankly you get more, uh, this is a higher dose too, so it's probably better for me. Um, you can do some research on vitamin D for yourself and see if that's something you wanna include. But um, after reading a lot of good uh, things about it, I decided to add that to my regimen. Another question I had was about the biopurine and what it looked like. And um, here's the bottle of that. I hope that's going to come out straight for you guys. If I'm going to, I'll take a picture also and, and add that to the site. But biopurine, from what I've read, is supposed to help your body absorb uh, vitamins and minerals um, better than not taking it. So uh, you get the, the optimum amount of vitamin um, when you take them. And then one thing I can't stress enough, if you can get this wherever you live, do it's a um, the holder for my vitamins um, I, it just is so great to be able to know if I've taken a vitamin or all my vitamins um, each day uh, some of them I have to take uh, in the morning and at night and so this is a great way too because it has a.m. p.m. on it and so um, it's just a great reminder and I, I don't know if, if you're like me and um, I've just got so many different things going on. Taking my vitamins is really not the highest priority, although it is a priority. And um, so it's great to have this as a reminder right by my kitchen sink. And um, I, so I know to take it and if I have taken it or not that, that time of the day that I wanna take it. All right, so in conclusion, ginkgo biloba not showing results yet. Might be my own fault because I've just been taking one tablet a day. Um, again, you know, there are going to be some mild side effects, and I wasn't enjoying the side effects. So I'm going to go ahead and start taking two now. Maybe my system's used to the ginkgo biloba, um, and, um, and we'll see if there's any uh, changes that we can track. So I will report back to you um, in a week or so. Uh, meanwhile, on Sunday, Joanne and I are gonna do a live chat on um, uh, YouTube. And so about 10 people will be able to participate. 
If you are interested in joining live, then go ahead and send me an email or leave a comment here on YouTube and we can include you, uh, let you know the, the information time and everything. Or you can uh, leave me a message on the uh, Facebook page also. That's Vitiligo Friends on Facebook. So I look forward to talking with you. It's gonna be a great time um, exchanging ideas and, and just supporting each other uh, live on camera and then I'm going to record it also so everybody else can join um, in and, and watch uh, to see what we discussed. All right, have a wonderful weekend. Um, in conclusion, I'm going to show you exactly what kind of weekend we're having here. I know you can't see me really well right now, but it's because the camera adjusts to the dark. I don't know if you live in where they have snow, but this is what we're looking at. Just a bunch of snow again.